We are at the B-52 Victory Museum, in Hanoi, Vietnam. Consensus has it that the majority of the B-52 in the museum, is the wreckage of a B-52D, named Cobalt-01, shot down on December 27, 1972, while bombing the Trung Quan rail yard, just to the northwest. The B-52 crashed in this area. Parts of the undercarriage, fell in a lake 300 meters north of this museum, that wreckage remains in the Hu Diep Lake or commonly now known as B-52 Lake. We will walk there soon. The navigator Benny Fryer, died in the crash. While the other five crew ejected safely, only four of the crew survived confinement, and torture in the Hanoi Hilton. They returned to the USA in February 1973. It's thought that Alan Johnson, the electronic warfare officer, Survived the crash but later died while a prisoner of war. They were taking part in Operation Linebacker 2. President Nixon had ordered the most concentrated air offensive of the war in response to further attacks by the North. During the offensive, sometimes called the Christmas bombings, 40,000 tons of bombs were dropped, primarily over the area between Hanoi and Haiphong. A total of 45 SAMs were fired at the bombers that night. When Cobalt-01 was within 60 seconds of bomb release, two SAMs locked on and began tracking the aircraft. The pilot was able to evade these two. While still in his violent evasive turn, they received a near direct hit by another. Every crew member on board, received injuries from the impacting SAM fragments. The wings were on fire, and the ruptured fuel tanks fed the rapidly spreading fire. All electrical systems were out, as well as the crew interphone system. The pilot verbally gave the order to bail out only 40 seconds after the SAM impact. A crew member said that Benny Fryer was apparently killed in the SAM explosion, as he collapsed forward on the navigator's table, and was bleeding profusely. His seat was the closest of any crew member to the point of impact of the SAM. One of the engines was found to the north of here, in the Hanoi Zoo. Up near the Presidential Palace. During Linebacker 2, 10 B-52s were shot down over the north, and five others were damaged and crashed in Laos or Thailand. 33 B-52 crew members were killed or missing in action, another 33 became prisoners of war, and 26 more were rescued. As of June 2019, 58 B-52 bombers are still in active service. The aircraft was last made by Boeing in 1962, it is expected that the B-52H, will not be totally retired until 2050. An undisclosed number of B-52s participated in the U.S. strikes, in eastern Syria on February 7, 2018. The SAM SA-2, was made by the Soviets, they adopted the design from the World War II, 
German Wasserfall missile, the missile control radar unit was called the Fansong. The missile had a speed of 1,340 miles per hour, with a ceiling of 85,000 feet. Effective range 6 to 15 miles.